So what is going on you guys and welcome back. So today is West Ham United versus Manchester United of the 2017-18 Premier League season. Now, to be honest with you, I think we should just go into this game um, being relaxed. You know, we've got nothing to worry about. We can't go down now. And, uh, you know, I just think we should play our own game. I feel like there's a lot more pressure on Manchester United to do well. Earlier in the season, they obviously beat us 4-0, first game of the season. And to be honest with you, we were just outclassed on the day. I'm hoping we can be a bit different today and, you know, our fortunes will turn. I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to be really cheeky saying this, I'm going to say 2-1 West Ham. I'm going to, you know, this is one of the first times I've predicted us to win in a long while, but I just think because we haven't got any pressure on us, and I'm feeling a little bit more confident, you know, so come on your minds, let's get to it. I cannot wait, and I am buzzing. Let's do it. start for West Ham to be fair uh, a good little chance I think Mark Dunbar will have a very very good tackle against Paul Pogba took the ball straight off him Lanzini gets it and uh, it's Lanzini's first touch just too poor gave the ball away but not playing bad first few minutes into this game and we are looking at the better team at the moment another chance there for West Ham United um, a great uh, ball from Aaron Cressa on the wing he boots it in and out of it just can't quite connect the centre I think if he did though we'd be one nil up just in that clinical finish it's all we're missing at the moment I think I think we could get this come on West Ham come on Adrian pulling off two magnificent saves, one after the other, absolutely brilliant. I think it's first of all, Alexis Sanchez had the shot first one, and sure not long after. Kept it out, I have no idea how neither team has conceded this game yet, it's been absolutely magnificent. Ah, thank you! God! Good chance, this has been a fantastic fan to go on to the main one of the day fans of West Ham. So it's a good, good old laugh this game at the moment. I'm just hoping we can score the shot them up, not gonna lie. It is so frustrating having him. Time nil nil. To be honest with you, I'm very surprised this game's been nil nil so far. Um, I think West Ham have been by far the better team in my opinion. I just think we've not put anything in the back of the net. Um, however, may not have had their chances. Don't get me wrong, but I think they should have got a goal as well. But I think West Ham should be winning this comfortably. I actually fancy to go out there and nick this, um, but you never know. The Mourinho side, they can always catch you on the counter attack and then you know go ahead and win the game so i'm hoping you know we can go ahead win this game and just couldn't shit i'll be so i'll be happy with the point as well but i personally think we should go for the win so come on your minds let's get to the second half and yeah very happy so far about 10 minutes into the second half not much has happened to be honest with you but may i have a chance west ham just need to take a chance now we need to put something back in there come on Over. I don't really know what he's expecting from that, but there we go. Oh, just 
need to put something away. Come on. I, in my, I think West Ham are outplaying Manchester United at the moment. I keep saying all this. I mean, I just need to score. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. And Shekiyati's gone down injured. Kiyoti looks like he's in a lot of pain, but yeah, hopefully something too serious. Oh dear, oh dear. I think I think I should change this game. Really hard not. We do not deserve to lose this. And again, almost had like a super safe or something. He just booted the ball forward, got the perfect run for Anatovic. Anatovic boots it in the box for Carroll again. And oh, Anatovic makes a fantastic run, boots it into the box to Carroll. And honestly, I cannot believe Andy did not put it away. So unlucky. Andy has another chance. I can't believe it. Honestly, really blown for myself. So disappointed with not being able to score. Everywhere. Oh, I'm forever blowing bubbles. The only thing is I'm scared because we're not taking our chance I'm just afraid Man United are going to have one decent chance yeah. and they're going to finish it. Pogba with an absolute obscene black tackle. No ball squared up to him. Mark Noble and Pogba have squared up to each other. I have no idea what's going on. But oh, there's a booking of something here. It was absolutely shambolic. Kuyai is on the floor. He is in pain. Sign up in there. Shambolic. So, so frustrating. The players going down so easy. They've been all over ours. Is there a referee on their books site? It's so frustrating. Full time 0-0 against Manchester United. To be honest with you, tell me I'm going to be sorry, but I think we should have won that. I think we're the better team. I think we're going to get three points against us. Look, we'll hands up better from beginning to the end. I'm happy with it though, I'll take it. Alright guys, I am back from the game now. It was West Ham United nil, Manchester United nil. And to be honest with you, I am actually overall very happy with the result. But at the same time, I'm a little bit disappointed that we didn't completely take advantage um, over the fact how poor Man United are. I felt that we should have won that game. I thought we should have been about 2 nil up at half time. But then again, that said, I think Manchester United had chances as well. I'm really surprised that game did end nil nil. But that's the Premier League for you. Um, I think at that point, I think that means Manchester United keeps second now and West Ham United are now on 39 points. We go again against Everton on Sunday, which is going to be, uh, it'll be an interesting game. I'd like to see where, you know, both teams have sort of got into the table. Everton have been a bit uh, in hit and miss uh, run of form currently, whereas West Ham have been sort of picking up some results. It'd be interesting to see what happens. It'd be fantastic if we were to beat them. Um, I don't think we've actually beat them in the Premier League at home since 06, 07. I think it's been that long. So, it'll be unless someone can correct me, which I'll be happily proved wrong. But I think that's the last time we did. We obviously beat them in the FA Cup back in 14-15 uh, with the FA Cup. But I don't think in the Premier League itself we've beat them at home since. But it'll be interesting to see what uh, will happen anyway. And I can't wait for it. So, yeah. Anyways, you guys, if you have enjoyed this video, do not forget to hit that like button. Comment below. Um, I'd love to hear your opinions of the game. Also, you guys, do not forget to leave your question below. I'm making an end of season review. If you leave a question, your question could be possibly used in my final video. So do not forget to leave one and I'll try to get back to you as soon as possible. And if you haven't already, guys, do not forget to hit that subscribe button. I will see you very soon.